What do you do, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to the Crypto Channel 329. Today's video, we're gonna talk about stable fund, and I have some really good news for y'all. So, really good news, and some not really good news for some of you. Okay, so they they ju they just did the AMA today. Okay, and here's a recap. So the BNB will go live on Monday. Okay. So BNB will go live on Monday, but on the new website. The old website will remain the old website only with the Matic token, okay? <clears throat> the new website will have the Matic, BUSD, and from Monday will have the BNB, okay? There will be some improvements on the interface, user interface, okay? So they will fix that and actually I experienced that so I, I logged in and used my ledger and did some transactions and back in the days every time you confirm something you know it takes you off the ledger but today I withdrew and redeposits and everything went through without disconnecting my ledger so that's good okay so they are in talks with Coinbase for their integration okay so in order to do that they will have to do KYC's okay um, two-factor identification will be live end of today okay 2FA will be live today bots trades 24 hours all right they have one senior trader and one junior trader and um, right so hot topic the visa card visa debit card okay so the conditions is the whole is is that people have to KYC. So the whole project, so everybody who's dealing with stable fund will have to be KYC. Know your customer. Okay, regardless if you want the Visa debit card or not. So anyone who creates a registered account on stable fund will have to buy. KYC regardless if they decided to use the Visa debit card or not okay so there will be a poll for 48 hours to see what the community wants so and then from based on the community they will make a move either go forward with the Visa debit card or decline the Visa debit card and look for other options okay so what's the KYC process it's very simple so if you use the crypto.com binance or any other uh, dex chain okay so you've done kyc in the past so basically you will have to uh, identify yourself like uh, with a um, driver license passport id card you know something that will have your name and your photo an official document okay and then you will have to scan your face okay so once that's done that's done and dusted okay and that's that's that um, so stable fund will not provide the contents of your wallet wallet holding unless authority approaches to visa food talk okay so they will not share your bags basically okay so regardless of the poll there will be a point where stable fund will need to be KYC again this project is doing so well right so this clearly is not an ROI DAP or a minor so eventually we all have to be kyc and that's the future because more and more the governments they want to um, regulate crypto because they know people are making lots of money with crypto so they want to regulate crypto so they can have a share okay simple words they want a slice of your cake that's why you know more and more we will see people getting kyc in crypto okay so this is become this is it's gonna be a new normal okay so if the vote is yes the visa program and KYC will be implemented in about five days if the vote is no we can revisit the visa program at later dates okay PayPal will be integrated regardless of the vote outcome it will be like transact okay in that only those who opt into the program will be KYC okay so once the pay PayPal is implemented okay if you opt in to be be able to be KYC all right so you'll be able to continue um, to use the stable fund if you opt out right so you will then 
have to remove your funds and pick another platform to make passive income because if you don't want to be kyc you ain't going to be able to roll with stable fund okay so well uh, yeah stay tuned in for more updates in regards to stable fund right so the poll will happen in the next 48 hours right so then from that we will have um a decision from the team okay so let me know what's your thoughts about the kyc and about this ama all right so let me know what you think about stable fund how it's heading and yeah if it's a good thing or a bad thing okay but beautiful is bnb is coming monday all right so i'm definitely gonna buy some bnb to roll with the bnb okay so i will try my goal is try to hit 10 bnb right so have 10 stake bnb and then roll from there okay but yes uh that's me done i just wanted to give you the quick and fresh news about stable fund and what's going to happen in the next few days so stay tuned in for more information hope you guys enjoyed the video i'm out